Hi there, Matt. So um, I've been waiting for the rain to pass and do it outside, which is where we usually do our description videos, but because um, there's not much room in here. But um, unfortunately, it's just rained all day. So uh, I thought I'd better just crack on and, and get it done in here. So um, I'm going to go up, up in close and show you anything that you need to know about. Um, I've gone around the tyres there on Dunlop. SB Sport Max is all round, so good quality tyres. The fronts are on about four millimetres, legal limits 1.6, they start at about eight, so they're sort of half worn just over. And the rears are measuring between five and six mil, so all, all good on that front. Uh, the wheels are unmarked, they're all in, in good order. And the bodywork's lovely, there's no dents, there's no scuffs. Um, there's a couple of minor imperfections, which I'll show you in a minute, a couple of stone chips. Um, but nothing untoward and uh, all in pretty good order really for the mileage that it's covered. So starting, I'll start on the this uh, passenger side rear bumper. Um, on the swage line here, obviously a car's caught the edge of it there. There's a tiny chip at the paintwork which has uh, been touched in but needs touching in again. Uh, there's actually two there. That's up in close. From a distance you barely notice it going down the passenger side it's a bit glary the light in here so you'll have to apologize but um it's all fine down the passenger side passenger rear wheel passenger front wheel as you'd expect on the sort of front end of it being black, the mileage that's covered, there are the odd stone chips. Um, I'd say the front bumper has been re-sprayed at some point because that's pretty, um, pretty good. There's not really any chipping on the sort of lower half here, which you'd expect it to be heavily chipped. Uh, it's not too bad, to be honest, so that's pretty good. Um, on the bonnet, there's the odd stone chip. Looks a lot worse under this light than it does in real life. Um, but as you'd expect on the leading edge of the bonnet you will find the odd the odd stone chip going around to the passenger side uh, the driver's side driver's side front wheel front wings all good both doors all good driver's side rear wheel Round to the rear bumper, where things have come in and out of the boot, there are a couple of tiny nicks on the edge, just here. Again, from a distance. It's nothing more than sort of minor imperfections, really. Um, moving on to the interior of the car. Passenger front door card into the passenger side passenger front seats all in nice order there's no wear on the bolster or anything passenger rear door card rear screens are all in good order no scuffs no scratches remote controls present in the center armrest which then closes down into the bench seat Same again on the driver's side, so rear door card, rear screen. The rear leather's lovely, doesn't really look like it's been used very much. Driver's door card. Steering wheels are all in good order. Screen's all good, there's no scratching on the sat-nav screen, which sometimes you get when people have used the wrong cleaning materials on it. All the way down through is all in good order. Driver's seat. Tiniest 
bit of wear on the bolster, but hardly anything. And there is a tiny mark where someone's pocket um, button or something's probably caught the leather. Uh, it's yeah, as you can see, a tiny little mark on the on the leather, but that's it. Um, see if I can get the current mileage up. Current mileage is forty-seven two zero seven, and uh, and that's everything.